Hey everyone, it's Carrie O'Donnell. Um, you may or may not know me, but I am a prisoner of St. Lawrence and my husband and I run the Young Adult Alpha program. Um, wanted to talk to you today about giving. I've been praying over the phrase that God never stops giving, which is so true, um, especially in this Easter season when we've just had the best example um, of God um, and Jesus giving his life um, for our sins. And um, in this time of crisis right now, it's just such a clear example of how um, we can live in his image. Um, I know that a lot of people are struggling right now. Um, they're, you're, a lot of people aren't able to leave their homes. They've lost their jobs. Um, and they're, they're struggling with their health um, and, and fear and worry and anxiety um, are a big part of our everyday lives. Um, and I have found that one of the best sources of comfort uh, in this time right now is the church. Uh, our St. Lawrence team has been fantastic, whether it's the Daily Rosary with Cecilia, Psalm You to Sleep with Linda, um, Mass on Sundays, Seasons of Praise on Mondays, even Father Gill driving around Brewster um, so that we can all attend adoration. Um, the church has been giving to us in so many ways. Um, and my family has found that, um, a tremendous source of comfort. Um, and in turn, we have been trying to support the church, um, through its own difficulties, right? We're all, um, trying to help each other. And the best way that we can do that right now, or one of the best ways is helping each other through giving to our own church who continues to give back to all the parishioners. Um, the team is working so hard right now. And um, the more resources they have, the more that they can do for us, right? So um, one of the ways that we can do that is through the WeShare program. I don't know if any of you um, have looked at that website. Um, the information is on the church's website, on the bulletin, um, or you can call the rectory to get more information. But it's a way of um, making your donations through um, electronic means. It's a little bit easier for everybody to access. And um, it goes straight back to the church and straight back into the wonderful things that they are doing. Um, I know that I'm getting three weeks to the gallon on my gas and clearly saving on some haircuts. So my family has found small but practical ways to um, figure out kind of how much we can give um, in addition to trying to keep up our weekly giving. So I ask all of you to think on it, pray on it, um, and f decide whether or not you're in a position to be able to do that right now. No matter what though, the church is there for you. And they want to hear from you if you need anything. Thanks and God bless.